Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, and today in this video I'm gonna show how you can delete the EFI partition of any drive or USB on Windows. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. So, let's begin. Before starting, you'll need to find the disk name and, for that, open disk management. And here you'll have your list of disks installed, identified the drive name, of which you want to delete the EFI partition. If you try to delete the EFI partition from here, all the options will be grayed out. Make sure to identify the drive correctly. Otherwise, making changes to any other disk may cause data loss or the inability of the PC to boot to Windows. Now, invoke run, using the Windows plus R shortcut and, then open disk port. Now, type list disk and, press enter key, to get the list of disks installed. And now, identify the disk, on which you want to make changes, for me, it's disk 1. After identifying the disk, execute the following command. After selecting the disk, execute the following command, for listing partitions. And now, identify your EFI partition, like the EFI partition, that I want to delete from my drive, was the first partition of the drive. So, I'll be selecting partition 1. For selecting the partition, execute the following command. And after selecting the partition, execute the following command. After the command has been executed, close the command prompt. And now, open disk management, and finally, you'll be able to delete the EFI partition. So, that was it, hope it was useful, consider like for the video, subscribe to the channel, and if you have any question, just comment down below, thanks for watching, and have a great day ahead.